we are discarded hearts, broken parts, lonesome crows in moonlit parks, lost souls with no train to depart, voices you hear long after dark, the midnight sounds in abandoned houses, strange parts of town where life never rouses, we are the words, the last beat of the heart, we are the sadness and the tears, solitary trickles down desolate cheeks, we are your fears, every single one of them. We are the hateful sound of a smoking gun, the terrified feeling when you have to run, because the faces in the crowd are all becoming one, and it is looking at you, directly into your soul, we are the hole that is left. We are in shadows that never seem to dissolve. In dark corners, we are the light removed. Once set to illuminate, now just musty faded yesterday's crumpled old pages of history books. We are the cold spots that chill to your bone. We are the places that you don't want to look. We are faded Valentine's cards left in a drawer. Wilted flowers in a vase, nothing more. We are broken down friendships, relations gone stale. We are a grim fairy tale. We are the past, the future and the present. Moments you don't want to navigate away. We are the worst and the best moments of a day. We are flowers in bloom, sunlight lit rooms, dissolving the darkness into dancing dust. We are the moments when it seems nobody cares and there's nobody to trust. But suddenly a hand appears to guide you by the wrist. We are human, with all its fragility, frail and beautiful, hurtful and hate-driven. We are the forgivers and the forgiven. We are smiles in children's eyes, soft kisses on lovers' lips, loving words that can be heard and all of the ones that can be missed. We are learning, yearning to understand the way the world should be turning, so we can write it down in words. We are the songbirds that sing on the dreariest days, giving a bit of brightness through the murkiest greys.